Does Biblical History Mirror End Time Events? This message is neither a prophecy nor a prediction. Presuppositions Dated events in the Bible align with secular history. Jesus and his apostles foresaw real events of the end times. In the Bible, past events often serve as a model or type of future events. Anticipating Jesus' return into the world helps to keep hope active. The tentative timeline described in this video consists of the following. Two mirrored sets of two millennia. Two mirrored overlapping sets of three seventy-year periods. Two mirrored periods of thirty-five years, of fifteen years, and of three and a half years. There were one thousand years between the Israelite conquest of Jerusalem and the Roman annexation of Judea and Jerusalem in the year 1 BCE. Seventy years between Herod's siege of Jerusalem and the crucifixion of Messiah at Jerusalem in 33 CE. Thirty-five years between the Messiah's birth in the year 2 BCE and his crucifixion in 33 CE. At least three and a half years between Messiah's baptism in the year 29 and his crucifixion. And fifteen years from Messiah's crucifixion and the first mission to Gentiles about the year 48. There were seventy years between Rome's annexation of Judea and the destruction of the Jerusalem temple in the year 70 during the first Jewish revolt. And another seventy years from the start of the first Jewish revolt in the year 66 and the end of the second revolt in the year 136. It was one thousand years from Messiah's crucifixion until the year 1033, when many Christians expected Messiah to return. The third period of a thousand years may signal the start of the end times, three and a half years, around the year 2033. It was another period of seventy years between the Balfour Declaration, envisioning a Jewish homeland, and the 1987 Intifada of Civil Rebellion. And yet another period of seventy years between the founding of the State of Israel and the Blood Moon Harbingers of year 2018. There could be fifteen years between those Blood Moons until the completion of the Gentile mission about the year 2033. Thirty-five years between the liberation of Jerusalem in 1967 and the escalation of civil conflict in the year 2002. And a final seventy years between the liberation of Jerusalem and the end of the three and a half years around the year 2037. Thus, the end time period of three and a half years might occur between the years 2033 and 2037. The final thousand year period would then start with the return of Messiah around the year 2037, culminating at the final judgment, then continue on forever. Conclusion because God remains sovereign over the flow of history, He remains free to act by His own calendar, not by human schemes such as this one. Let biblical predictions keep your hope alive, but do not count on human date setting. Jesus asserted, This gospel of the kingdom will be proclaimed throughout the whole world as a testimony to all nations, 
and then the end will come.